Hey, how you all doing? I'm sorry it took so long for me to make another video, but I've been having trying times. So thank you for even clicking on and subscribe. Today's topic is being in courage. Man, I was uh, listening to the, the gospel song be encouraged no matter what's going on. Man, it seemed like a test star of life, especially in this day and time. Dealing with the quarantine is it's, it's so hard. It's, a, it's real hard to, to overcome. And man, I drive two hours just to get to work. And yes, I'm happy that I was able to be able to still work, but I'm not having enough time with my family. I only have one day off. My my son, he always asks me, he's like, Dad, when are you going to have your own business so you can spend more time? He's very, very in tune and love being with his mother and his father. Both his siblings. I mean, it's hard. All that I can tell him, I'm, I'm trying. I mean, just beginning to be in a, you know, making YouTube videos and, you know, asking for collaboration with bigger YouTubers is, is hard. I mean, you know, some people just being skeptical of who they let in. And it's, it's only right. I mean, I I look at the, the Ace family. Uh, I look at the, you know, Corey and and then and Karma. Man, by the way, they got a, they're having a way harder time than I can ever imagine. Being young and then having so many resources that you can use, and how our life started to take hope to them. I mean, it's very challenging. And then even even with the AIDS family, they they have over probably what 15, almost 20 million subscribers, but they did it by being consistent. Um, they didn't give up. I mean, they are human at the end of the day. I mean, I, I, I hate it when people try to criticize somebody else, you know, trolling somebody else because of they thinking people just had it. No, people don't have it. They, they create them themselves their by the will of God being behind them and they're in tune with each other. Even with the Prince family, they've been having trying times. I mean, hey, they just making content about their life. I mean, a lot of people. But at the end of the day, they who they are. I mean, you're tuning in to them. It's so much negative negative things is just like how you breathe. It happens so instant. Quick. But it's hard for someone to say some positive things about you. They just had a brand new baby. The Ace family did. They just had one. He, I, I'm excited for him. I mean, he's had a little boy just like that was a long time for me to have a little girl. I had two boys and February the 14th of 2020, I just had a little girl to get around this car. I just had a little girl and it's like one of the most proud things that I ever could have done. I mean, my wife gifted me on Valentine's Day a beautiful baby girl 
And I mean, Chloe is so full of life. She loves her dad. And like, I mean, she truly loves him. And I, I love her. I told her I've been. It's been, it's been waiting debut for you. I mean, a year before that, year and a half before that, me and my wife, we had a miscarriage. And it seemed like everything was going to the shower. I mean, it was just pissing in the wind at times, trying to get it together. But as a man that's trying to do the right thing at all times, it's hard for just something just to happen. There's always a meaning behind it. And it was a meaning. And it was a meaning for me to just stop being super serious about everything. And just kind of take time like how time is. I always plan things. I always make sure that everything is almost like military way. Hey, this, that, 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 that. I mean, I draw some lines and I connect the dots. I'm, I, I try to stay on it. I mean, that, that, that's who I am. My wife knew that there. My time is my biggest pet peeve. I mean, I like to be on time. I like doing things in a timely manner. Everything is like that. But sometimes, she taught me. Sometimes, it's just being in the moment. And it makes it, feels a whole lot better. Does. I remember the last trip we took um, to Florida. I ain't been to Florida ever since 2016. Um, that was the first trip that I said I wasn't going to record. I wasn't going to record it. Uh, I just going to, you know, involve, involve myself in the moment. I mean, my my wife, uh, youngest sister, just had graduated high school. Uh, I st we was on an upcoming. Man, I rented a, a Tahoe, and we went down there, man. I saved up over $6,000, and I told my wife, we're going to spend every last bit of it. And the kids was happy. I mean, we, we went to, what, the Magic Kingdom. Epcot, we went downtown Disney, we went all these places, went to the malls, we shopped, we did it all. And it was an experience. I asked God, I said, Lord, please let me experience and taking my family on a vacation and just letting them enjoy themselves. And it happened. I was so mad. Man, it was so good. I, when I felt that first time, it's like every time after then, it's always like, "Hey, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta make it happen, even, even better." And it has been happening better and better. Each, each trip after that, we, we've been having fun. Uh, I mean, I haven't recorded because I was, I never thought about YouTube or none of this, so I, I just started. Make a long story short, this time is very, it is really depressing at times where I really want to be around my kids and try to find work at home than anything. So to the next video, please subscribe, like, leave comments to make sure that this video can be seen across from people. I love you guys for helping me on this journey that I, I'm trying to make. Just be encouraged. Think about all the good things that have happened and to get you through the, these rough times in life. All right. Love you, family.